we were meant to create. Sometimes our desires to create are blocked spiritually, mentally, emotionally, or even physically. And this prevents us from reaching our highest aspirations. If you are an entrepreneur or you would like to become one and you're in need of some sage advice and direction, then you're in the right place. As a successful entrepreneur, spiritual guide, and intuitive business coach, I can offer you the clarity and support you need to find success and reach your goals. With decades of experience as a trusted tarot card reader, a franchise owner, my practical and spiritual approach to entrepreneurship will help you reach your full potential as an established business owner. Whether you're struggling with making tough decisions or simply trying to find your path in life, I can help you learn the tools you need to create your business dream. Take some time today and schedule your free consultation with me so that we can begin to make your business dreams a reality. Hi Aquarius, thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into it. Thank you God for blessing Aquarius with a clear, concise message from you. So this is a reading about the weekend. The card that I got for you, only got one card, retirement. That's what I'm talking about. So you're going to take a break. You know, uh, this could just be an opportunity for you to pursue some dreams. Maybe this weekend you're going to think about a long-term goal fulfillment or achievement. Um, you're going to make the best of your time, too. You know, you're going to do what you need to do. I'm going to get some rest. You may even go on vacation or, or uh, you may even dream about a meaningful vacation or where you want to be. This also could just be you thinking about maybe a change in your employment. It could even be you um, hanging out with maybe a loved one who is retired. Okay, so some of you could be going on vacation. Uh, you're going to make the best of your time to pursue your dreams and so forth and so on. So how is Aquarius weekend going to turn out? Let's see. How is Aquarius weekend going to turn out? Aquarius weekend. Very nice. A gift. So like 17, that, that definitely is you. Maybe you're going to be a gift or you're going to bring gifts to others. or You you are the gift. You know, your presence is a gift here. Um, this could even be reconciliation, a declaration of love, um, either from you t to someone else or from someone else to you this could be again a gift here uh this could be I, i'm hearing like a meeting or meeting someone uh they have something for you they have something to say this could be a surprise meeting this could be let's see what else what is happening poverty so maybe a gift from somebody that got left out or, or you're feeling left out um someone brings you something that um puts you in a place where you feel better about yourself um it could be lack within you or lack of confidence within you. And someone really pours into you or vice versa. You pour into someone else. You could just be thinking about how you want to go on vacation. You'd be thinking about maybe once you get some money, you're concerned. So your weekend is going to be one of you having fun, making the best of your time. There's somebody here who maybe you left out. Woo. Whomever this is, they are not doing good. The bad health card. Um, you could even be visiting someone who, you know, wow, who could be in prison or a bad health. Definitely could be visiting someone who is in prison. Um, you could be praying for their recovery, especially if it's a family member. You could be visiting someone who is um, having a tough time um, physically or someone who is re in recovery, some type of recovery. Uh, you can also be visiting a grave site is what I'm hearing. 
Um, some of you could just be thinking about the good times with a particular person. How is Aquarius weekend going to be? So it's like you're taking time just to um, settle down, set back. You're thinking, some of you also want to think about how you can maybe shift, change jobs, or get out of maybe something that is not paying you enough. How is Aquarius? Yeah. Think of, um, so a lot of wishful thinking, a lot of maybe not enough action taken, but a lot of dreams. And maybe you'll be in a very dreamlike state. The Page of Cups I could meet someone new, okay? Um, if not someone new, Ace of Wands, definitely with the devil. So it's just like a lot of wishful thinking. This could even be someone in regards to you, Ace of Wands. Someone thinking about how they can reignite or ignite something with you. It could be sexual in nature or how they can get you to come out and play or someone's giving you a gift. Um, some of you could be, over, you know, just overindulging, overeating, drinking. Um, it could be bad health or you could be traveling for your health. Uh, you could be traveling to go see maybe a doctor or something about um, maybe, yeah, because we have bad health here. And then you have justice something have to do with the legal system also with the courthouse <clears throat> some of you could be sick going through some type of sickness illness <coughs> now i'm coughing hmm. some of you trying to make something right or you got to go somewhere to make something right or get a payment or you're trying to get payment for the Queen of Wands in reverse, you don't want to be seen or you don't want to be out or you don't want to be, you don't want to make too much noise or you don't want to network or you don't want to be around or um, you're not on the scene or judgment card with the lovers. So you could be going to get a second opinion is what I'm hearing, maybe about your health health related issue uh you could be trying to change your health regimen or some routine or you go into some routine doctor's visit it has something to do with legal legal profession um what is this about for aquarius yeah something happened all of a sudden the queen of cups and the ten of swords it's like you're trying to maintain your emotional stability balance ten of swords something out of the blue disappointing feeling like you just can't take anymore stabbed in the back what is going on or this could even be somebody else i don't know someone feels like you don't like them love them sexually sexually attracted to them anymore you're not sexually attracted to them they were trying to get you to they were trying to recover the relationship or revive it or get forgiveness but it, it just could be completely over Some, it's completely over between you and someone what is this about what is going on here for aquarius this weekend I mean, somebody's dreaming about you, daydreaming about you, wanting you back. They're in a place of where they can't get over you or they can't move forward. Um, you could be hanging out with family, visiting family. You could be traveling. You're just going to make the best of your time wherever you are. Heavenly heavenly signs. Okay, so you, you're getting like some feathers, flowers, butterflies, coins, music, like... You're getting signs from heaven, from your an the angelic realm or an your angels, guardian angels, that you need to get some rest or you need to give it a rest or you need to take a load off or you need to chill or rest or um, rest in the energy of. What is, what is this about rest? Parental care. Some of you are going to go check in on your parents or you need to. Um... You're going to check in now on your grandparents is what I'm hearing. Um, you just need to do something leisurely. You don't need to do something that is like heavy duty or, you know, you're expending a lot of um, force or uh, energy. 
Yeah, some of you are thinking of ways of how you come out, come into a new career. You're kind of emotional about it. You don't know how to do it. Again, healthcare change. Some of you could be getting a second opinion. That card talks about second opinion. Um, how to change your health, what you need to do, healthy living, eating, diet, regimen. Let's see what else. What else is going on for Aquarius this week? So it's a lot of thinking, action, a little action being taken, but a lot of emotional, maybe conversation or emotions. Grief work. Yeah, some of you need to grieve. Some of you going to the grave. You're going to visit the grave site. You're going to, you know, maybe talk to your loved one. Uh, we did have heavenly signs that you have angelic help, presence around you. Seeking and finding. So some of you are really trying to find what is your divine purpose here in, in this life. Some of you could find somebody new. Um, finding your soulmate or something like that with the page of cups everything new kind of starts off small with the page of cups seeking and finding also maybe new knowledge you could be changing your uh, belief base or you could just be reading this card comes yeah you're welcoming something new this one to flip over a windfall of knowledge of changing your mind can't make it up something comes in where you change your mind you're also going to change your body how you look, how you present yourself to the world, or you will be. What's some advice for Aquarius this weekend? It looks like windfall. Welcome the new. There, there could be a windfall. Money, luck, time, energy, love, all things good with the windfall. You're changing your mind, though, about something. We see here a lot of cards that fell on the floor. So three of pentacles, learning something about how you do something. Six of Swords, you're going to move on. Six of Cups, the what is that? The Hangman, and then the Eight of Wands, and the Four of Swords. So this is good. So some of you are traveling. You need to rest and let something rest. Let something come into you. This is Law of Attraction. So let attract the energy. Don't try to run after it or chase it. Stand still with the um, Hangman, Temperance. Let it come to you. Sacrifice. Let divine or divinity speak to you. Uh, be in a place where you can hear meditation. True inertia. Not doing anything. Declutter your emotions. Six of cups. Connect backwards. Get into simpler times. Hanging out with loved ones. Just enjoying yourself. Indulging. Eating. Drinking. Six of swords. You definitely could be traveling. It could have something to do with health or collapse or something falling apart. A collaborative effort, three of pentacles, again, something about second opinion or looking at something for a second time or a third time. This also talks about where you are best suited, you know, in career. And you're going to find that out by maybe meditation, you know, because the seeking and finding talks about meditation, talks about prayer also. Talks about knowledge. So this weekend is about trying to change your career, trying to figure out how you can do that, where you would best be suited, learning, reading, resting, understanding that abundance comes to you. It's an attraction type of energy. It's not something you chase after. You have to rest in the energy of knowing that you can have wish fulfillment, line of cups, Wow, money coming to you. Got 888 coming up. Um, that you are divine. That you deserve it. Queen of Pentacles, you could be learning how to maybe monetize something. Uh, different stream of income. Understanding that, you know, uh, true power comes from the divine. It's not something that you do or you go get or you can manufacture. You have to listen to the divine. You could even be getting messages from the divine magician. You could be coming a, becoming a great magician, learning esoteric knowledge. You're going to put it to good use. Wow. And then you get complete happiness. You might keep this knowledge to yourself for now because you don't know if you can put it out to the world or you could share it. Other people are wondering what you're doing. You got some, you got heavy spies. People from your past, friend groups, loved ones, lovers, 
wanting to come to you or wanting to know what you're doing and what you're up to, especially this weekend. So this is what I have for you, Aquarius. It looks like your weekend is jam-packed with rest. Should be anyway. Also, picking up a book, learning, coming up with a plan, writing it all down, figuring it out, you know, um, second and third opinions in regards to maybe your health and health health-related issues or someone else's health. Visit, visiting someone who is not doing well also. What we want to remember initially is that you need to retire. You need to let go of. You need to just hang back. This is what I have for you, Aquarius. If it resonates for you, if you want to connect with me in regards to your business endeavors or maybe even career endeavors, go ahead and schedule your complimentary discovery call where I can get on the call with you to see if I can even help you if I can be of assistance to you. Um, and then you can also uh, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Uh, readings are on sale, 40% off. Use code 40OFF at checkout. And then also the 10-minute video recorded, 10-minute phone Zoom readings are on sale. $50, take advantage of that. And if you want to connect with business-minded individuals each and every month, join the KTMG monthly conference call, the Keep the Momentum Going monthly conference call, where you get all things practical and spiritual about your business, either establishing yourself in business, growing, or maintaining your business. This is what I have for you, Aquarius. Have a really good weekend. Take care.